Hey, Shalom, Shalom, it's your brother here, Yakanin. First and foremost, I want to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Wakakwadash, Baraka Thumb. I'm going to give double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone who rule well and that taught me this truth. And salutations out there to the hopeful elect, the brothers that are putting this work diligently, sincerely, and truthfully. All right? Salutations out to you brothers, man, and keep enduring, okay? Hey, today's lesson is going to be about just get the fuck up off your ass, man. All right, we in the fucking end days, man. All right, and brothers want to sleep in until motherfucking 12, 1, 2, 3 p.m. All right, wasting half your fucking day away, man. All right? I think the elder made a video with the guy a few days ago talking about, man, brother shouldn't even be sleeping in until no fucking 11, 12, man. Unless you work fucking third shift, then you on a different time schedule than everybody else. Well, if you, you know what I'm saying? Go to fuck the bed early and wake up early. You know what I'm saying? Like, brother sleeping their whole day away, man. If you sleep eight hours a day, all right, that's four months out your life that's gone, man. Eight hours a day is four months gone out the year. You got eight months to live. You know what I mean? You sleep eight hours, say you work eight hours. What are you doing the other eight hours? Are you making the best of your time? All right, because time is something you can't get back, man. Use your time wisely, man. All right? Scripture say, hey, man, our salvation is nearer now when, than when we ever believe, man. The same video as I made yesterday, man. You going hard? Because brothers, man, they act like just because they're in this truth, they can half-ass the world. You're still supposed to go hard in the world, too, bro. Like, brothers find that they Israelites and do the work and start to fucking get lazy, man. Take a fucking, uh, uh, take a backseat. As long as they feel like they got a vid and read a few pages, they good. Like, nah, bro, you still got to fucking take care of your body, work out, eat good, take care of your family, provide, work, make money. Still go hard in the world, man. Just like you're going hard in the spirit for y'all by Shem Yabashai. Hey, man, still go hard in the world, man. All right, because he said you are God, but you said die like men, man. We are powers. And powers don't waste no fucking time, man. You think Yahweh and Yahweh Shai wasting time? Nah, every time they had when they was alive, when Yahweh Shai was walking the earth, you think he was wasting time sleeping until motherfucking 12 or 1 o'clock? No, man. Get up off your ass and make something of it, man. All right, brothers be half ass and shit, man. A false imbalance, man. You go super hard in the spirit, but then you half ass the, the, the worldly shit, man. That's a false imbalance, man. As Christians say, a false imbalance is an abomination. All right, but man, I feel like brothers know this truth, man. They just half ass they, the rest of their lives. Oh, I just can't wait for the kingdom to come. The kingdom, man, you don't wait for the kingdom. You attack the kingdom, man. That's in all aspects of life. You take care of your body, you're going to take care of your mind. You take care of your mind, you take care of your body. You take care of your spiritual duties, you take care of your worldly duties, man. But you do all that to the best of your ability. The Lord didn't put us down here to half-ass nothing, man. Scripture say angels that left their first estate in the everlasting chains of uh, uh, everlasting chains of bondage, man. Roughly paraphrasing, man. So Lord willing, if we be at that number, man, we are angels, man. We were angels, man. We wasn't sitting down here to fucking half-ass nothing, man. Get the fuck up off your ass. Wake the fuck up and be about your business, man. We're too late in the fucking game in the end times to be brothers to be fucking lackadaisical about this shit, man. Brothers fucking getting lazy, man. Letting their flesh fucking take over, man. Going into their lustful desires, man. All right, hey, don't you know it's a sin to fucking be overweight, to be obese, to be fat? False imbalance. Falling into fucking gluttony, man. Not working out, man. Not sweating, man. The human body was meant to sweat, was meant to exercise. The heart is a muscle. It's meant to work. It's meant to pump blood. The harder you work, the easier your heart beats at night, man. That resting heart rate. That's how you know how good of a shape you in, man. If you under like 50, 60, you know, you, you, you in good shape, man. I suggest brothers start to get like a monitor or something, man, where they, they can measure their resting heart rate, man. Because the number one killer in America is what? It's heart disease, man. From what? From lack of exercise and from lack of poor nutrition, man. Two things we have full control over. But no discipline, no consistency, man. 
You can't be just disciplined and consistent in the spirit, but you lack that discipline and consistency in your everyday life, man. That's a false imbalance. Brothers need to wake the fuck up, man, and really understand how serious this shit is, man. Yeah, we know it's all in the spirit, but we know it's also in the flesh, too. Still got to master your flesh, too. And sleeping in all fucking day, eating all day, not working out, not taking care of your duties, not going hard, is not mastering your flesh. Brothers is wasting their fucking time sleeping in, man. All fucking day. Because they're going to bed 2, 3, 4 fucking a.m. Go to fuck the bed early. What the fuck is you doing up? The earlier you go to bed, the earlier you can wake up, man. Buzz need to get on their fucking game, man. Stop bullshitting, man. Imagine how was trying to sleep until fucking 12, going to bed at 3, 4 fucking a.m. Man, how was trying about his business. Little woman, wake up to see the next day to go hard, man. Buzz is taking life and they time for granted, man. Buzz need to get right in the fucking spirit, man. All praise to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai by Shemakak Wadash Barak and Thumb. Double honors to the elders and apostles of the great millstone who rule well and that taught me this truth. And salutations out there to the hopeful elect, the brothers that are putting this work diligently, sincerely, and truthfully. To you I say, Shalom.